Yo, what's going on guys? How you doing chat? How's everybody this Easter Sunday? How y'all doing guys? Motherfucking happy Easter dudes. I, uh, <clears throat> I mean, I don't even know what the fuck to do on Easter to be honest. Like, it's just another day, ain't it? <laughs> to fuck, fucking go look for eggs and shit. Uh, motherfucker, how's everybody doing? This is the first stream back from Japan. Fucking, uh, I'm gonna tell you, yesterday I was fucking jet lagged up the ass, homie. I was not, I was like motherfucking tired as shit. I'm still a little tired, but like, fuck it, dude. Honestly, like, whatever. It's not a big deal. How y'all doing, though? <clears throat> Sunday is, or today, Easter. I know last year, Easter, we did like an Easter hunt thing, but with obvious reasons, we can't do that this year, unfortunately. But it is what it is. It's fine. Um, we're going to recap some Japan, and we're going to also, uh, I don't even know, just chat about stuff. I suppose, or just chat in general, I guess. I mean, motherfucker, what else to do? <laughs> you know what I mean? So, it is what it is. Um, yeah, I want to just get the fuck out of, I want to move ASAP, dude, honestly, like, because I just want to move, and then I want to do some more traveling. Japan was really fucking fun, dude. I do not like being in this place. It's bad vibes, and it's just not fun at the moment, so... I want to, uh, I want to like, I want to go back to Asia, dude, honestly, but we have some responsibilities here and we have to just do what we got to do. Uh, yeah, no, no hotels today, as you can see, but fuck it, dude, like, it doesn't matter, to be honest, so it's not, it, it, it is what it is for the most part, uh, or, or maybe it is a hotel, what am I saying, like, it doesn't matter, I don't know. Uh, yeah, Korea would be cool, but I don't know, Japan, it was a great, it was a great time, it was a great trip, I didn't stream on the last day, unfortunately, I'm sorry about that i just was not feeling it i just felt really really fucking just shitty that day so i'm sorry for that but um i do want to go do some more traveling stuff but we have to fucking move first i want to try and get out of la by this week uh to be honest like that's all i want to do is just get the fuck out of here by this week and then you know get that the fuck out of the resident way sleeper and then continue still lies to the community thank you dude appreciate it homie uh <clears throat> Let me see. Thank you, Hubert's dogs. Appreciate it. Streaming in LA without a streaming permit. <clears throat> Let you, me dude. contact yes. the authorities. Yes, thank you, dude. I appreciate that. Um, okay, so um, I have some plans. I have some ideas for actually uh, moving, which, you know, it's, it's not going to be hard. It's just annoying for the most part. And, uh, you know, I don't know. I, I want to be out by this, by this month, to be fucking honest with you. It's just not... Uh, it's not fun to be here, so don't worry about not streaming the last day. Okay, well, thank you, Jacob. Appreciate it. No, I, I should have streamed the last day of Japan. I just motherfucking didn't, so I'm sorry for that. But, uh, I mean, hey, in Japan, we streamed a lot of hours, dude. We streamed, like, hella fucking hours. I mean, I thought the 22-hour stream was pretty good. Uh, a lot of trains, but it's like, whatever. Um, I mean, you, I can't fucking fly, so it is what it is. Um, I'm still a little... I don't, know, I don't know if I say I'm jet lagged, but like, I don't even know. I just feel fucking weird. So, I don't know. I look healthy. Oh, well, thank you, dude. I, <laughs> so the, the food in Asia really helped me a lot. I haven't had any fast food in like two weeks. Uh, so that's pretty good for the most part. Uh, okay, Sharon, I don't, I already know where I'm going to go. It's not going to be Vegas, homie. I don't want to tell anybody where I'm going to move to, but <laughs> you'll just see when it happens. It's just not, move to Vegas. not anyone's uh, business at the current time, so. It's all good. Um, but we'll recap it, and uh, we'll see. I'll do a Reddit recap, and we'll go for the past week on it, um, and then we'll go from there. Florida's uh, yeah, a good spot to be, but there's not really much that happens in Florida, dude. So, All right, let's see what we got here. <clears throat> I wanted to do some Easter thing today, but like I said, obviously there's no... Take of sponsor only mode. There's no, like... There's not really, we, we really, we just can't, so, <laughs> as you all know, so. Uh, thank you, Sophie. I appreciate that, homie. No, I'll keep it in sponsor only mode. Thank you, dude. I appreciate it, though, homie. Thank you very much. Uh, Jesus died on the cross for you, ungrateful pig. He did die on the cross for me. I mean, for, unfortunately, I am a, uh, I'm an atheist. Well, I'm agnostic. I'm not an atheist. I, I do believe in a higher power, but I don't believe in religion at, the, at all. So, uh, I believe that when you die, you go to the next dimension. Um, which I don't know if that's, you know, a thing that y'all could believe in, but that's what I believe in. Oh, this is that figurine that I bought from Japan. Hey, this shit's looking really good right now. This thing is fucking awesome. I need to get the other one from my parents' house. So I have two of these. I have one that we bought from Japan. I have one at my parents' house. You moving to St. Louis. So this shit's fucking dope. No, definitely not going there. 
Definitely not going to St. Louis, bro. Unfortunately, sorry. <clears throat> Thank you, dude. I appreciate it. Remember, super chats are <sighs> refundable and are one hundred percent guaranteed. Thank you, dude. Go ahead. You can uh, you can do that, homie. I'm okay. That's thank you very much. Uh, all right, let's go through the past week of motherfucking the recap and let's see what's up. <clears throat> like I said, I apologize. I'm a little <clears throat> a little out of it right now. So, all right, let me make the cam smaller and let's go with this. Come to Romania so I can get that big goblin deke. Uh, thank you, dude. I appreciate it. Uh, okay, so for the past week on the Reddit, it's the, the Reddit's fucking, you know, interesting. But it's uh, you, like I said, some people are just stupid on it, but or like not stupid, but just some some people, you know, they just don't even talk about what's going on. They just I, I don't really care. It's fine. The fucking Reddit got killed off when I opened it, so it's whatever. Um, throwback to the wholesome Hawaii content. I mean, I don't know if I say this is wholesome, but I truly think definitely if you should move to Detroit. No Detroit, dude. We're not going fucking to the goddamn Detroit. <laughs> no, dude. That would not. <clears throat> that would not be fun. Release the plebs beta. Thank you, dude. I appreciate that, Samson. Um, I don't know if I say it's wholesome, but that's definitely some some interesting content. That's for sure. Just, uh, dude. What are y'all going to think when I move? I'm going to be alone. I'm going to be real with you. I've, I'm a little worried. I'm a little nervous about moving because I haven't been alone. Can you well, sing happy birthday to my bro, Joe? Happy birthday, Joe. I uh, hope you're having a good one. You must be Jesus born on Easter. So um, I'm a little worried about moving because I haven't been. I mean, I've been, I mean, I'm emotionally alone, but I haven't been physically alone in the past two years. So I'm a little worried about moving and being like pretty much alone, just having, uh, you know, <clears throat> not having a bunch of people around at all times. So, you know, that post got me thinking about it. EBZ, Scotchroom Care, you know, these are all people I've had around me and I'm going to obviously be uh, a, more of a loner when uh, that happens. So I'm a little worried about it because I don't know how I'm going to react to that. I don't know if I'm going to feel better about myself or worse, but, uh, you know, I guess only time will see. I mean, I don't know. What do you guys think? I mean, obviously, I could just make new friends or whatever, and that's obviously my goal. I just don't know how that's going to go because I haven't done that in, I haven't done that in over two years. I, you know, the last we time I moved from my parents' house was to L.A. That was two years ago. So I, uh, moving's like, it, it's uh, it's a it's a whole new thing. It's like restarting. Will you ever go to Pittsburgh, Pa? Uh, I mean, I've been to uh, Pennsylvania, but. Uh, I'm probably not going to go to Pittsburgh anytime soon, but thank you. Um, let me see. I mean, it sounds like fun without a bunch of leeches around you, mind you. Well, Mike, I mean, I don't know. That's bad mentality, but I'm just saying, like, it's a whole restart on everything, on my whole social uh, circle, I guess. And it's just, uh, it, it's going to be nerve-wracking a little bit, I think. But uh, it'll be interesting, for sure. Remember where you started from? You don't need all these weird Andes and leeches to carry to stream. Oh, I know that, Neb. I know I don't need people to stream. I'm just saying it's going to be... It's just going to be so different to what I'm used to. And I'm very nervous about it, but I'm very excited at the same time. Like, I'm ready to fucking move. And like I said, I want to be out of this motherfucking place before the end of the month. That's, I'm really, really working towards it, so. I'll come and be your friend. Love you. We were, uh, we packed all, you know, a lot of shit today. And we just, I've been looking at some different apartments and stuff. Um, as long as they don't, uh. Move to San Bernardino. Tons of content. Fuck me on my credit. Ha, 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 ha. Definitely not going there. I place ghetto as fuck, but thank you, dude. Out of California, thank you. Get a dog. Keep you company. You know, I was thinking I do want a dog. I do. Hey, I saw good bro. Dog only member chat on. You only want to hear yes men sucking your goblin cheese penis. Yes, thank you. Also, 3K viewers, lol, take my $5. You're going to need it, dying streamer. Uh, yes, I do need your Happy your Easter dollars. eyes. I mean, I Keep up the good thank stream, you, CX. Will you ever come to Canada again or no? Anyways, have a good day. I do want a dog, to be honest. Thank you. I do want to go to Canada as a travel thing, but not to live there. Um, I was thinking, when I went to Japan, I saw those little tiny sh Shibuyunas, and I saw, like, uh, I went to a go eat today. I saw a bunch of dogs, you know, running around. Like, I miss my fucking dog and in Florida with my parents. I fucking miss my dog, Patrick. So, I do want to get a dog, uh, like a miniature pincher. Those are my favorite dogs of all time. So, obviously... I don't know if I could take care of a dog. I mean, I took care of Patrick pretty well, but, you know, I didn't travel or anything, so it's different. If I have a dog, and then, like, I, I go traveling and shit, like, I don't know. I guess you bring your dog to, like, a vet or something, but still, it's like, 
fuck, dude. It's it's. I don't know. I I I just don't know if I have time for a dog to be honest. But I would Where's really Vince like Pat's them. Skull? I like uh, cuddling them and stuff. So, um, let me see. What'd you say? PM me dicks. Let me see. I'll come over and be your friend. Love you. Uh, I mean, you can come over. And say Why did you ignore sure. both my donos, scumbag? Oh, Hate by the you. way. Thank, thank you, dude. Um, by the way, this is uh, people were saying I was gonna get addicted to the cigarettes. No, definitely not, because you have this, you have jewels, which is so much better than cigarettes. Cigarettes are fucking nasty. When I was in Japan, I was smoking all the cigarettes, but and that shit was fucking disgusting. But this shit is quite good, sixty milligrams of nicotine. So I'm not even worried about that at all. Um, all right, so here we have. Let me see the black ice design. All right, this guy does not look anything like me. He's like he. This dude looks like a fucking. Uh, like, Ice J.J. Fish. He does not look anything fucking like me. All because you see somebody who's skinny doesn't mean they look like me. Like, you know what I mean? This guy looks like he does fucking... I mean, God knows what. You know what I mean? He just looks like he's fuck, fucked up or on something right now. But definitely not me. I don't give a shit what anyone says. Definitely Atlanta or Dallas slash Austin? Um, Atlanta was really nice when I went there. I really did enjoy Atlanta. Uh, and the Dallas was really, really cool when I went there, too. So, I mean, I don't know. Austin's also a really good place to go as well. So, I don't know. I'm looking at apartments in a couple different states right now to see which one is probably going to be the best for me. Uh, let me see. You get rejected by the goblin. I'm going to kill myself. All right. Well, listen. I said you can come over. If you want to come hang out, come over hang out, dude. Um, but, you know. TFW, you we'll get rejected goes. by the goblin. I'm going to KMS. Thank you, Dix. I appreciate that, homie. No content plan. Let me tell you something, Oscar. You're right. There is no content planned because, uh, I mean, you know the situation I'm in, I'm sure. And I don't really, I just, I can't really do anything like while I'm here, to be honest. Like, it's not really, you know, you know the situation. Ice so. keep grinding, you're fine. I jet Atlanta 3000 to Xbox Live, keep grinding, Ice, we're all still here. Thank you, dude. Let me see. Japan's been real, I said, and this person says real boring. Uh, I don't really know what to say. Did y'all think Japan was boring? I thought I had fun. I, I had fun in Japan. I don't know if it was boring, but I had fun. Uh, I thought this shit was cool. People in the chat were seemed to uh, enjoying the content while it was happening. Um, so, I don't know. No, you didn't like Japan, Mike, at all? Hmm. Well, I thought Japan was fun. Just lots of trains. What are you talking about, dude? I only went on a train during the 24-hour stream. And that's only because I, I can't fly. Oh, you're saying you liked it. Okay. Yeah, I can't fly. I was During the 22-hour stream, I think I was on trains for a total of like two and a half hours, which is not bad. So I thought the shit was fun. I don't know. Um, like we saw a, different, a lot of different stuff, and uh, I think that was good. I, I mean, you said I didn't stream enough in Japan, and you might be right, but I did stream a, more than I have streamed in the past month for sure. So, I mean, it's a good start. Did not go to the Suicide Forest, Hondro, because there's that's unnecessary, and who the fuck cares about that shit? The only so. good stream was the one with Swedish Chad. The rest was rubbish. Should have just let him stream the rest of the trip. Vold man childing around getting his little toys. I mean, that's just negative, man. Um, I thought the other days in Japan were pretty good, too. I mean, definitely not... Uh, I mean, I, I, I'm assuming some of you guys were expecting me to go there and be disrespectful for content, but that's not really what I want to do that's not really the kind of uh content i was trying to go for in japan I, I didn't want to go there and be all fucking disrespectful and loud and shit and just fucking annoy them i wanted to go there and like try to adapt to the culture and like see how i did and just see how everything went so but thank you dude thank you flame i appreciate the member dude uh the feedback is negative homie and will not be accepted well thank you i appreciate it the only bad thing about asia is the time zone difference fuck everyone they japan are so was fucked. the best content in a long time homie thank you dude i I thought so myself, too. I mean, I, I thought they were good. Um, no, I, the time zone difference, the only thing that I CX did not in like. The chat. I'd stream at like 10 o'clock in the morning, and it'd be like fucking 6 p.m. everywhere else. And I'm just like, fuck, that sucks. Um, I hope you stream more. Just interacting, less sightseeing. But in Japan, you got to see Japan, I guess. Well, the thing about it, Neb, was I tried to interact with people, but they don't speak English. Like, it's hard. It was motherfucking hard to interact with people in Japan. I quit my job to come be homeless Goddamn with you. English. And, I, like, I try to, but it's just, the conversations just, they're just fucking awkward, and they just don't work, and it's just, like, I don't know, it's funny for a little bit, but it's, like, for every person, it's just getting annoying, I feel. Uh, I quit my job to come homeless with you. Listen, Dex, if you want to quit your job and come homeless, come hang out with me, you're more than welcome to, 100%. 
Let me see. EBC's content is this fucking some guy and I'm assuming Can you do a grinder stream and try to invite a guy into your hotel room and turn him into a streamer instead? Uh, let me see. Do a grinder stream and try to invite a guy to your hotel room and turn him into a streamer instead? We've done that before. Uh, (laughs) We, uh, you know, those are are fun ideas, but uh, whenever I do shit like that, people just shit on me because I'm wasting somebody's time. Uh, So I just don't do that You're asking how Japan was to your few members that can type in chat. I mean, that's kind of smart brush off any criticism, right, Paul? The real viewers fell asleep to your Japan stuff. Japan, the well, best stream since desert camping in Vegas. Thank you, dude. Um, I'll say this. If the, the viewers who, like I said, were expecting me to go to Japan and be disrespectful, uh, yeah, that's not, how, that's not the content I was going to provide. So if you didn't like, you know, the stuff I provided in Japan, then I'm sorry. Um, but, you know, I don't know what you were expecting. <laughs> My first kind of stream. I love you, Daddy Ice. I mean, it was CS. fun. There was no callers. There was no fucking anything. I had no issues. I had no... I literally could stream. I didn't have to worry about getting pressed for, for fucking by clout chasers. I didn't have to worry about fucking dumbasses coming up with their fucking camera. I had to worry about callers. I didn't have to worry about any of this shit. I actually, for the first time in like two months, had so much fun streaming. Whereas, obviously, in America, when I do IRL, it's like... AIDS half the time, so it was, it was Hey, fun. Ice, hope you're doing well. What are your plans for Australia? And there was no drama in, in Japan, too, which I'm assuming a lot of uh, this guy, you know, who donated, he wanted drama, I'm assuming, too. Well, I actually enjoyed no drama. That was really, really good for me. I like the Japan streams. I like Kimberly, but it would have been funny to see how far you could have pushed it with those three girls. Fuck the haters. Well, I was being pretty sexual one day. I'm like, I was saying that, oh, you you know, that they're down the fuck or whatever. So that was pretty Shave far. Eyebrow. But Water I didn't want to, like, shirt. scale Denny's. them off. Profit. Uh, thank you, dude. Shave eyebrows, watermelon shirt, Denny's. Okay, I mean, that's some old shit. Maybe, like, fun. When streaming dies, we can go through gay porn together. When streaming dies, we can both do gay porn together. Thank you, dude. I appreciate it. We could do that. Uh, I enjoy streaming for the most part with a breath fresh air. Color. Content that colors makes the experience miles better. Thank you, dude. That was that was really good. Yeah, I'm sorry that I that I fucked up on the last day of Japan, but it's okay. Me watching was well, not okay, but I'll work on it. Me watching an ISIS sign stream. Thank you very much, dude. I appreciate that. That's a good meme right there. That's I didn't even remember me falling asleep on the train. Japan made me a fan of you. Sad of these kids being toxic. My main platform is Twitch. You are the only reason I watch Live on. Wish you were on Twitch. Come back, please. Better audience, please. Why do you automatically assume people who did not enjoy your stream wanted you to disrespect people? Swedish Chad didn't do anything bad and we enjoyed watching him than all your other Japan attempts. I mean, he was being really loud and obnoxious and and if I was doing exactly what he was doing, people would say that I was being disrespectful. People were saying I was being disrespectful when I was walking and eating food at the same time. So, you know what I mean? I was trying to adapt to the shit, but... uh, Hey, I don't know, bro. I thought uh, the stream with him was really, really good, but I thought the other ones were pretty good, too. Uh, I don't even remember me falling asleep on the motherfucking plane, but thank you, dude. I appreciate it. Let me see. Flashback to 40K Andy. Five million total views. LA people are using me, by the way. See, like, posts like this, I don't really understand. People, You guys want me to leave LA, right? I mean, I want to leave LA. I don't like motherfucking LA. Let me say that during the RV trip, it was really, really fun, but I'm not friends with any of these guys anymore. Besides, let's say Mexican Andy and Dan Kwan is like acquaintances. Everyone else here is like not friends with me anymore. You know what I mean? I'm not friends with them anymore. So uh, for the most part, at least. So, I mean, I I don't know, like that's not the relationships I want to build. I don't feel fulfilled in life. I feel... I feel sad and like not, I just feel unfulfilled, you know? I want to build actual relationships with people. I don't want to build uh, relationships that are strictly business. That's not fun. And that's very unfulfilling. But um, but I I will say that, uh, you know, not everybody in LA is using me, but, you know, I would say half of these people definitely were (laughs) for sure. You know, Cassandra and Brandon uh, as like two main ones there. Was he a danger to himself and others? Okay, I do not even, I did not know that I was actually going to slam her into the pole there. I saw a video saying that I'm a psychopath because I like hurting Kimberly. 
I, let me just say, I don't like hurting Kimberly. I just enjoy... I, I, I enjoy the cuteness that she that she expresses when she says, ow. I don't know if that makes me a psychopath, but I think it's kind of cute. So I, uh, you know, it, it just, I don't know. It just like makes me, it just fucking turns me on, dude. I don't even, like, I don't know if that's weird, but it's just, it doesn't like turn me on sexually. It just, it's cute. Like, I don't know. Uh, for the most part, it's like, uh, it's like when you pet, it's like when you squeeze like a dog and like it fucking like barks or something. It's like fucking cute, dude. Not like squeeze it like a hurting way, but like you squeeze it and it's, and it's like licking you and shit, dude. Uh, you know what I mean? Like, I don't know if you know what I'm saying, but that's what I'm trying to explain here. Uh, let me see. I donated 10 Japan. You scammed me. I thank for the three years of content before I donate another 10. I love you. Thank you, Marcus. I appreciate that, homie. Thank you very much, dude. You're not supposed to? Well, I guess I'm just a psychopath then. What can I say? I don't know. Let me see. What is this? Never mind. Okay, this was another never mind thing. Thank you. Damn, a week of uh, the recap here. These are the top posts. That's annoying. Let me see, but it's fine. It, it only makes sense. Uh, ideal girls for me. Okay, yes. Listen. These are the only two traps I've seen in Japan. And they were actually, uh, they, they were, they were interesting. I mean, they were, <laughs> I would, if I was gay, like, actually, I was, I'm straight. And, uh, I would probably get with this one right here. Not this one's obviously a man, but I would get with this one. He played it off really well. Like, he literally, I, I thought it was a girl for a second. And if, I was really drunk. I would let this person blow me for sure. Um, as long as I don't see a dick, as long as they don't talk, as long as, you know, like I could pass that shit. I could let it, I could pass it and it's good for the most part here. <clears throat> let me see. What is this? Genius in their fields, both showing off their pride, have strong, solid grip. It must be Dangler Andes. I don't know what the fuck that means, but I guess this. What the fuck is this? Oh, this is Michael Jackson, dude. Okay, I don't know what that means. I mean, obviously, Ken's not a fucking child, but uh, that's some weird-ass shit. Back when the community was wholesome and made memes like this. Let's see. Yo, I just don't know if you see... This is old school right here. This doesn't have many views, but it's a quality meme. Let me see. The quality meme. Let me see. Wild Mexican Andy encounter. Okay, dude. Is it, is this is old school as game? fuck. I'm kind of scared. But uh, we're gonna check it out. Uh, uh, don't fuck with me here. I'm gonna delay. Oh, don't make this happen. Dude, I like I like this. Making money is easier than I thought. Hey, what's up? <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, he knows your name, my Huh? Mexican Andy? What? <laughs> no! He's only level 6, You can't stalk me, Mexican Andy. Hell no. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> no! Bro, that's clever! Oh my god. Yeah, fuck you, I'll say fuck you. That's not funny. Oh, this is just some old. From our own. I do like positive videos. I like to commentate when I'm positive. I'll let it play out though. I mean, I've still seen some memes like this here and there. But yeah, for the most part, people like making dumbass looking drama shit, so. <laughs> what the fuck, dude? What the fuck was that? You know what? Fuck this shit. I I'm out. Zero XP? What was the point then? <laughs> Alright man, have a good day bro. Take care. <laughs> Pokemon encounter dude, that's some good shit. 
I mean, yeah, the memes uh, three years ago were quite good. Uh, way before the fucking any drama stuff, which is great. And I fucking wish that I did not pander to a lot of the drama content. But, you know, mistakes are made and we can fix that, so it's not a big deal. Um, biggest streamer to ever come out of the whole Trash CX network? Thank you, dude. Yes, Pepper is a good girl and she's, uh, you know, with a, a viewer now who's really, really good, so... That's good. Mi Let me see. Missed your meeting with Destiny about the Twitch ban appeal. Ice, how do you expect other support? You can't even help yourself. Okay. I'm meeting with Destiny tomorrow to talk about stuff. So, just throwing it out there. We had to reschedule because I thought... I thought yesterday was... No, I, okay. I thought it was Saturday. No, I thought it was Friday, but it was really Saturday. Because my whole, like... My mind was, like, messed up from the plane ride. So, I thought... I on Because, like, motherfucking... I flew out on... Thursday in LA, and then I landed in Friday in LA, but I thought it was, or so, I don't know, I was just confused, I thought it was Thursday still, and then I slept, I thought it was Friday when I woke up, but it was really Saturday, but it doesn't matter, because we're, we're, we're meeting tomorrow, so it's fine, like, shit happens, not an excuse, sure, but it happens, you know, it's fine, um, because he's not offended by it, I talked to him about it, he's fine, so we're gonna talk about it tomorrow, meet up, talk about stuff, and, you know, hopefully it all goes well. Uh, Mexican Andy, after leaving the CX network, is lost a bunch of weight, of course. Imagine not meeting with Dusty, trying as hard to get ice on ban from Twitch, shit lagger's excuse, Dusty should stop trying. Okay, thank you, dude. Um, what the fuck are you talking about? Listen, I like Destiny, but he did also ghost me, too. You know what I mean? Just throwing it out there, but it's fine. It's not a big deal. Motherfucking shit happens. We're both busy people, and I was busy getting some snoozing, and he was busy with life, so it's fucking, it's, you know, it's fine, dude. Literally, tomorrow, it's gonna, it's, it's not a big deal. Uh, what is this? A fucking Mia's tracksuit Andy, dude. What the fuck happened, dude? Okay, now the shit's being fucking gay. What the fuck is going on? Bro, I, this shit is so gay. What, I fucking hate this stupid quarantine shit. It's fucking god-awful, dude. Alright, top for the past week. Back to it. I should use the old Reddit, that's true, but I kind of like the new Reddit. Alright, way back to this. Okay, let's see. Yes, me is Track Sandy. No, that's not. I do not look like Track Sandy, but thank you, dude. I appreciate that. Yuri's trying to contact Paul. I saw this. Uh, Yuri apparently is trying to contact me, but I mean, she doesn't even speak English, though. What are we going to talk about, dude? She's using a translator on this uh, when she wrote that because <laughs> the translation's a little off, which is uh, kind of funny, but I don't know. Ice, will you marry me so I can get a green card? I mean, I would if I, I, dude, if I was single, I would have pretended to marry you. Watched for sure. over a year, gave Matt and me life so much better. But that probably wouldn't matter, anyways. Uh, let me see. Thank you, Matt. What'd you say? Fucking. Thank you very much, homie. I donated ten in Japan, and you scammed. I said thank for the free three years of content before I donated, but have another ten because I love you. <laughs> well, thank you, dude. I appreciate. When that. is being disrespectful stopped you from providing content? The streams in Japan were boring. It's a simple fact. Compare the environment of the streams to last year. It's sad how much this died. Well, let me tell you. When does being disrespectful stop me from having content? Let me uh, let me let me explain. I'm trying to change uh, the vibe of who I am as a person, and I'm trying to change uh, my image and make it a little bit better. So I, I don't want to be this disrespectful person who goes around and does disrespectful shit. You know, I just wanted to have like fun times and chill and no drama and just, and that's it. Like I fucked up for the past, uh, you know, year and a half with a lot of drama shit and I'm trying to fix that. I'm trying to get over it. So, uh, you know, there's going to be a lot of slowdown for sure because that's Check this what out. I'm trying to do. We expected this point. type of content in Japan. True OG content, King Vertical Bar. Let me see. What is this? Tom Green. Yeah, I saw some Tom Green stuff, but let me see what. This is right here. This is what we expected in Japan. Hi. Is it because the monkeys, the monkeys, when they look at this, they'll be like, ah! 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 
I don't know why I have to take my clothes off. What the fuck? Okay. I don't understand why I mean, I just went there to explore shit, so. How come? I thought it was fun. What do you mean? No, 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 no. What? Dude, if I would have done this in Japan, listen, here's the thing. If I would have done some shit like this, there would have been some fucking post on Reddit slash our videos or something. The live streamer does this shit blank. Like, you know what I mean? Like, I don't want, like, I'm trying to, I, like, I, I don't want people to, like, uh, you know, make me look really, really bad when I'm just trying to, like, do stuff. So, like, that's kind of funny. So I just prefer to just be pretty chill in Japan instead of doing stuff that people expected. Because I don't want to be, I didn't want to be like Logan Paul, dude. Because that's how people, I, I guarantee there were some people that were waiting for me to do something that was funny. So, they can make me, they paint me out to be like Logan Paul, which I obviously don't want. So, um, you know, because I'm trying to fix my image. Because unfortunately, Chris, I am starting to care what people think. I shouldn't care what people think, which is true. But... I don't want people to like, I just, I don't want people to think I'm like a shitty ass fucking person. Um, because it sucks. Nobody wants to hang out with me or do stuff with me. So yeah, I'm trying to fix my image to obviously uh, change that. Cause you know, it sucks. Like to be honest, me not caring about what people th thought in the past two years has probably affected me a lot. So I probably should start to care. Unfortunately, do you hate me, baby? You, Junior. Appreciate I'm it. getting that vibe for own scam. Let me see, what is this? Uh, I miss content like this. Let's see, what is this? Let's be honest here, Paul. Yeah, yeah. This Reddit is rubbish. I P2 would make this recap half decent. Is Thank you, dude. Let's go to, uh, let's go to Mexico. What is this? LA was great while it lasted. Battery? What about the battery? Stay positive, fam. A-okay -okay hand. All right, we got the battery from under the fucking chair. Don't worry, we got it. All right, how, how do we get inside? I miss content like this frown. What is this? Just me That's trying to go into Mexico? You guys ready? Yeah, well, I was very naive. What's that? This is a year ago. I was pretty naive. I'm an attention whore. Actually, I is gay. Ones. Ice, ice, ice. I did not want to go into Mexico, dude, honestly. So, why am I smoking cigarettes versus vaping? Uh, no, I, I was only smoking. I small that food came to Poseidon and was moved to a storage unit with roaches. Some Muslim no. guy helped him move CX in the chat. He moved into a storage unit, dude? Bro, I'm sorry. That sucks. I feel bad for you, BZ. Do you have streamers over to Mansion for departing a party? Will you do one stream with Sam before leaving? Do whatever makes you happy and successful. Um, I mean, I probably I don't do, get like, the hate for ice. He's fucked up in the past with leeches, but been watching him for bare time in his Japan streams was a straight redemption. That's what we all want to see. Wish you the best, mate. Thank you, dude. I appreciate that. Pepper was um, a spy. We all know it. Add Jatlana 3000 to Xbox. Love you. We'll be fine. Paul, all this will thank blow you, dude. up. I appreciate that. Um, what the fuck was I going to say? Um, I don't remember. But, oh, yeah. There's going to be a... I want to do, like, a Munch departing party. Cancer. I do want to do, like, a one last thing with, like, everyone. I'll invite everyone that I've met in the past, you know, two years in L.A. And if they want to come over, hang out for one last thing, CX I will do that. The and then, you know, I'm going to depart and be on my way, obviously. So... It's like a one last hoorah. It's like, a, you know, we'll do like a little party or something. But, um, you know, that'll be on one of the last days that I'm here. So, well, I'll just drive over to like fucking Long Beach or somewhere where I can CX in the chat. And not have to worry. So, thank you, dude. I appreciate that, Junior. Um, but I don't know. What do you guys think? So, obviously, you know, I want to fix my image, which means I'm not going to be doing stuff that could be classified as disrespectful or toxic. So. My content's gonna be a little bit more laid back. I, don't I think know Tom Green acted like an idiot. Had you done half of it, the people complaining would be screaming how disrespectful you were. You can't satisfy hating assholes. Comedics can't even spell. Okay, thank you, dude. I don't know if that's what people want to fucking see me being more laid back, but I think that's what I need to do for like a little bit. So, um, I don't know. What do you guys in the chat think about that? Thank you, Samson. Appreciate that. I'm not catering to SJWs. I'm just like not trying to. I'm just trying to get away from a lot of the like toxic content that I've been providing for the past year. Um, you know, I want it to be more like wholesome, which means I have to slow it down for a little bit and then, you know,
get back into it, but like on a different sort of vibe, you know what I mean? I don't know if that makes any sense, but um, I just want to go back to how I used to do it, you know, how I used to stream, where it was like just fun, I go live, it was fun. CX was, in the chat. Everyone had a good time, and then, you know, it was that was it. Whereas, you know, the past year, it's like I go live, there's drama, and like all this, like no one's having fun. It's, it's just awful, dude. It's fun for the viewers, but it's not fun for for me or anyone involved on the streams. So, so didn't you say you were going to stop smoking nicotine? Also, what's stopping you from streaming outside, Arn, since you have a live view? A year ago, you would have went out in a bunny costume for Easter. Um, I need a filming permit to Plaza stream stop right scamming now. my donos, love you, give me a facial. Uh, so I, I'm not going to, uh, like, I can't, <laughs> I just can't, dude. Um, but thank you, dude. I, I appreciate it very much, homie. Um, yeah, I'm smoking nicotine because, uh, I don't know, I'm just, I, I just have a lot on my mind. So, smoking nicotine to get it off my mind, which is great. Uh, but thank you, dude. I appreciate that, homie. Do what you think. I say rebrand and be wholesome. Thank you, dude. I appreciate that, homie. Cooking streams and P.O. Box streams. Hey, I do want to open up a new P.O. Box. Cooking streams would be cool. I don't know. Like I said. To fix your image, you need to stream. Stop blaming everything on your lack of motivation. You're lazy and you have no passion and you use your viewers and everyone around you as an excuse. Grow up. And that's what I'm doing right now. I'm growing up. That's why I said I'm going to start being more laid back. Uh, I'm, you know, I am going to stream more. I, I shouldn't just say that. I should do. So I'm not even going to say that. I'm just going to do. Um, I am going to stream more. Trust me. I just need to, uh, like... I just, you know, just gotta fix my image. That's all I'm saying. So, I mean, and if you're I, if you're wondering why, it's just because motherfucking it's for myself, dude. Like I, I'm gonna tell you, chat. I've not been happy in a long, long time, and I was very, very happy in Japan. And there was no drama. There was no toxicity. There was no trash. It was just me. And he I was too is recycled garbage. Literally no creativity. Thank you, dude. I I agree with you. I appreciate it. Um. I was really happy in Japan. Why do you blatantly avoid reading America, my old donos? So I want to obviously be more wholesome, and I don't want to do toxic shit. So, just throwing it out there. Like Mr. Old... Benson's on Twitter. Love me, I love you. Drop ten. I actually did a Bob Ross painting stream like three years ago, Dad. I could do another one. That would be cool as fuck. Uh, the sub so pathetic. I didn't give fuck a bigger advice. Let me say. I was I trying to turn down his content for his comeback on Twitch. I'm shame. Being funny doesn't mean being rebranding as some G-rated ice cemental soy boy shit. Oh, did I say G-rated? I did not say that. Um, I'm still going to curse and shit. I did not say I'm going to be G-rated. I'm just saying I'm not going to be toxic, and I'm not going to do toxic-ass shit, and I'm not going to go outside and do IRL without having a plan because I know that I'm going to get callers, and I'm going to avoid getting motherfucking callers. Like, I'm not going to walk into a store, and their business gets fucked because of me. I'm not doing that anymore. I'm going to have plans when I go out and do shit. There's not going to be no fucking... Oh, let's aimlessly walk around, and then, oh, I walked into your business. Oh, I'm sorry, you got a bunch of one-stars, bro. Like, I'm not doing that. Like, I have to have a plan. Just go with the memes again instead of drama. Bob Ross Painting is a good example of you doing the meme content in the past. That's a good idea, Neb, and that's exactly where I, the kind of shit I want to get back to. I mean, me painting a Bob Ross thing, like, drunk as fuck, that'd be funny as shit. And that's not G-rated at all. But it's not toxic at the same time, which is good. Let me see, PM me, Dix. What'd you say? Why do you blatantly avoid reading my donuts? Let me see. What'd you say? Please stop scamming my donuts. Okay. What are you saying, dude? F Munch is cancer. F in the chat for F Munch. Um, do you hate me, baby? I'm getting that vibe. I don't hate you, Dix. I'm sorry, dude. Thank you very much. I appreciate that, homie. Uh, I actually do look at my sub quite often. I just uh, haven't recapped it in a while because obviously we were busy in Japan. So. Let me see. Stream sniped ice today. Here's the video. What is this? Ice oh, yeah. <laughs> what the fuck is this? Strawberry Vision stream sniped ice? <laughs> is it okay if I take a picture? Yo, I've seen this girl in the chat quite often. Is she? Yeah, for sure. Really? You this watch girl, this 13 year old girl is a sponsor, dude. That's some good Push shit. Rooms? Yeah, I do. How old are you? I'm 13. 13? Wow, that's young. All right, let's do it. <laughs> That's some good shit, dude, right there, homie. Thank you very much, dude. That, she, she was a nice girl. This is why everyone hates you. Ignore Dono's BTW. I do apologize for that. Thank you very much, homie. Let me see. With love from Japan. Yo, this chick was cool as fuck. CX homie. in the chat. Not FBI shit, but thank you, dude. I appreciate that. Strawberry Vision, she my girl. Well, she a good viewer. That's what I'm saying. Uh, the last 
scuffer. Here we go. What's this? Oh, this is a good. <laughs> this is a good ass fucking photo right here. Make up with Brando and hook up with Tom and Andy. Do a no jumper interview for Elite Cali. Uh, I mean, I've already done no jump. I've interviewed with Adam like. You should do a no times, jumper so. interview before you leave Cali. I think it's uh, overdone. But there's a documentary. As I said, we're working on a documentary for streaming. Um, it's a real documentary with high production value. We put like 30k into this, so that this documentary is going to be like the 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 final like goodbye LA shit. You know what I mean? I mean, it's not going to come out till later this year, but like probably. But uh, it's when it comes out, it's going to just cap every, recap everything from beginning to end of the LA era. And it's going to be quite interesting. 30K, yes, on like cameras and, you know, all this other shit. So it's, uh, I didn't put money into that. There was a producer, obviously. So uh, it's like very high quality shit. And it's, uh, you know, we have some good plans for it. I don't want to tell you what the plans are, but it's some good plans. And hopefully that documentary goes some places because we put a lot of effort into it. Not really me, but the producer and the director. Please obviously. do me one favor. Change this TDS voice. It multiplies the cringe of these already cringe donators by a factor of the chin. <laughs> Listening to them makes me want to find a rope and share. Cheers. Well, I mean, I do like the voice. It, it's actually the most, uh, you know, you can, the voice sounds the most like, you could hear it the better, like the best out of any of the other voices, I feel. You can understand what the fuck it's saying, so it's quite good. Well, thank you, dude. I appreciate it. Uh, thank you, JR Vlogs. I appreciate that, homie. Jaban, what is this? Okay, Jaban, like your band. Thank you, dude. That's really, really good shit. So now, that's uh, that's a good recap, dude. That's the week, past week recap of this shit. So let's go with uh, the past. Let's just go to hot then. And let's see what's going on on here. I mean, hopefully when we meet up tomorrow with uh, Destiny, that goes well. I don't know what we're really going to talk about, but hopefully it goes well. CX in the chat. Oh, bag of peas. Here we have leaked photo of Bone Clinks confronting Blade about pissing. Okay, so Bone Clinks has his own streamer house, which is cool. Uh, Blade actually moved out of here, and he went to uh, Bone Clinks' house, and apparently he got kicked out of there in three days. I don't know if that's true, but, you know, it is what it is. What is this? No content. Thank you very much. A stock PNG of a hand grasp. Have you heard anything about getting your stuff? No, I haven't, dude. They, I don't have any of my shit still, unfortunately, but it's, it is what it is. Let me see, can't expect a revived Reddit at the barely any recaps. Oh, I know that, Mike, but this is a good start. Uh, let me see, Paul's pick, pick of Paul's recent content. Wow, dude. That's some good content right there. Oh, yes, I still have to do the community service, which when I move, I will start that. Uh, what happened to keep the community updated? Why tweet out a video saying you do the next day, not a single tweet from you if you're going live on Sunday? Well, I go on Joe Rogan podcast before you leave LA. Oh, we tried to go on that, like, for the past year, and I haven't been able to get on it, so unfortunate. Let me see, what is this? Fixed it. What did you? Oh, yes man only chat. Thank you very much, dude. I hate the yes man stuff. It's so fucking lame, dude. I just I don't like the word the, the yes man phrase. It's just like, I mean, it doesn't matter when I'm gonna, when I move, I'm gonna be alone. So there's not gonna be any yes men around me. It's just gonna be me, my girlfriend, and you know whoever the fuck else. I was trying to change his image. Thank you, dude. That's some funny shit. Let me see. Seeking out to become a better person is all good, but not going to lie. Dusty's meetings unsettling. SJWs are far worse persons. The Destiny meetings Your unsettling. logic on how Cassandra mean? used you as flawed is more used her for the streamer house. Even Cassandra friends agreed she's genuine. It's just you weren't a good friend to her. I mean, I try to be a good friend of Cassandra, but you know, I mean, like I said, we both we both went into that relationship with motives, obviously, which already tainted the friendship from the beginning. So you know, it is that, that's what I'm saying. Like, that's why I want to move and try to find a new social circle because uh, I don't like hanging. I, I, I fucked up with a lot of my friendships here. Like, I started it with motives, and you know, vice versa, and so did they. And uh, it tainted the friendship from the beginning. And that's not how friends are supposed to be. So, uh, you know, I've learned from that. In the future, when I make friends with people, they're probably not going to be streamers. They're probably not going to be fucking, you know, content. They're just going to be people I hang out with. So, New York City has a lot more content than Austin or Dallas. 
Dude, but I don't like New York City, though. That's the thing. I mean, I've been to New York a few times, and I've never liked it. And it's also really, really cold in the winter. Like, I have to move somewhere where it's not going to be cold in the winter because I can't... I'm not going to stream outside of some snowy-ass weather every day. That's going to be AIDS. Come down to stuff. San Diego. Uh, I want to get out of California, but hey, San Diego is a nice city. I like to visit there. It is very chill. It's like a really, really chilled out version of LA. Um, obviously there's a lot more, uh, you know, younger people there, but, uh, I don't know. It's, it's interesting. Let me see. Imagine not meeting. Yes. Thank you, dude. See you at TwitchCon Paul Park Champ. Okay. Thank you, dude. I don't know what that means, but thank you. Why do people want... I used to pursue Twitch so badly, it doesn't make sense to me. Let me see. What is this guy saying? Whoever that white knight for Cassandra is off yourself. Cassandra is the most fake person we all see through it. She's now using tracksuit for a place I live in London. Fuck that gutter slut. She sucks. Thing, right? I'm assuming I love you, Paul. Right. Using my free premium. <laughs> Thank you, dude, and uh, thank you, uh, Joshua. I appreciate that, homie. Um, I'm assuming everyone's talking about that because the Destiny uh, thing, what he said on stream, but I mean, I don't really know. I mean, like I said, we're going to meet up tomorrow, and we'll, I'll, we'll just see how it goes. We'll see what, we're talk, what we talk about and what, uh, what goes on over there because I don't really know what conversations we're going to have, to be honest. Why, did, why make a video about this? This is literally just a Twitter update video. Of me just talking about why I didn't go live. Motherfucking saying I'm going to go live tomorrow. Like, why the fuck they make a video out of this? Let me see. What is this? Stop the hate. What is this? Let's read this. This looks like a pretty good, well-written paragraph. Not found. Fuck. Yo, is this, is like new Reddit glitched or something? What the fuck is this? Like, why is this shit so scuffed, homie? Dude, this is... <laughs> Reddit is so trash with the fucking quarantine, dude, honestly. Like, it's so glitchy, dude. Old, I'm just going to use the old Reddit. Um, okay, I have to type old fucking dot old Reddit. Missy Saga playing social streaming on time every day and update your community more frequently. Uh, okay, thank you. How do I do this? What the fuck is this shit? Why can't I fucking go on this shit? It's because I'm not logged in. Okay, that makes sense. Okay, that makes that looks a lot better. That makes sense. All right, what's that donator was right. San Diego would be a great place to move. There's a lot of genuine people there. For real, seriously, think about it. Uh, thank you, dude. Um, I do like San Diego, but I don't want to move there because, you know, taxes and stuff. Love your content. More to come if you ignore the leeches. All right, let's see what this guy had to say. I used to maybe be a lazy live streamer with questionable behavior, but you guys are the worst. You guys are just hating on this guy 24-7. It's getting annoying, so pathetic. Don't you have lives? Like, so what? He is terrible. Like, who of us is perfect? But hating on this guy for no reason seems unfair to me. Why? It's like he owes you something at this Ice. point. It's just live Your depression streams. is tied to your drug use. Which is tied to your loss of Twitch and Caroline. Twitch was easy money. People with half your talent making 20k a month as desktop bandies hang in there. Cassandra wasn't paid to do anything. She's a user. Uh, I believe it or not, I've never done drugs besides marijuana. <laughs> like, uh, I've never. Well, I mean, I, I've taken Xanax and Adderall before, but not consistently. That's just like uh, Xanax on flights, Adderall just when I was in fucking college, dude. I've never done coke is what I should try to say, actually. Because um, I'm assuming that's the drug that everybody loves to fucking say I do. Oh, I've done MDMA as well. But I've never consistently done shit like coke or whatever. Um, the most consistent hard drug that I've ever done is MDMA. And that is when I fucking go out to, like, I don't know, EDC or something. So it's not really consistent. It's just, like, every few months. Let me see. Um, go watch Greek or Soda TFU or someone... Your guys are treating ice as if he's your drug that's really need to function properly. This guy's just explaining a lot of shit. I used to enjoy hating these guys so much that they're all that there is, blah blah blah. Yes, there's one well streamer suddenly. Like I saw fifty viewers, he's getting five hundred viewers and making bank. Anyway, stop coming here if you hate and still watch. Okay, thank you, dude. I mean this guy's uh got an interesting point, I suppose. 
Let me see, how much does it take to update the site? Okay, so isosign.com is uh, probably not gonna be up for a while because I don't really know what I wanna do with the site. It's not gonna be a network, so I don't really know what I want to do with the site. It's just gonna stay in maintenance until I figure it out. I was thinking maybe I put some stuff in there that makes watching the streams more like uh, good for engagement. You know, tax is only up to 13% state tax in California, so unless you go live in Michigan and save 10% and freeze your sack off, the state doesn't matter. No, I pay like 40% taxes in California, dude, which is awful, but uh, thank you, dude. So I, I want to put more stuff that is good for engagement for the streams, but I don't really know what. I'm trying to figure it out, to be honest. Uh, if you have any ideas, then you know, post in Reddit or you know DM me on Twitter or something and you know try to figure help me figure it out but I don't really know to be honest shout out to Ice Poseidon for putting ski mask candy on we appreciate you love the ski mask candy community okay. shout out TTD you have to promote the team thank you dude I remain biased and appreciate all you have done thank you dude I appreciate that homie very very fucking much um that's some good shit ski mask candy dude that's that's some crazy shit do you when I moved do y'all think there's gonna be some people that stream slime you with cameras still because, I don't know, that's going, it'll be interesting to, find, to figure out if that really still happens. Let me see, what is this? Why do people want ICE to stay banned on Twitch? There's nothing but hurts them. What is the, let's see here. Because his content will only be desktop streams because he'll be afraid of getting banned if he goes out. Uh, okay, I mean, that's an interesting point. I mean, I, I disagree with that, but that's an interesting point. Um... Throwback to when the community was wholesome, sure. Here's the thing. The other 30 is federal tax. Maybe talk to an accountant. Like I said, when I move, I want to get back to the more wholesome stuff. So I don't know. Like, I'm not going to do normal IRL. Like, I'm still going to do IRL, but it's not going to be how we've done it. It's either IRL when I travel, IRL when I have something planned, IRL as in, like, shit like around the house friend? that's, like, wholesome as fuck and not fucking toxic. Like, doing a painting stream or something or cooking stream or whatever shit like that but i'm not gonna do like just walking around sidewalk and go inside fucking stores and shit because it, it it's there's too much emphasis on the negativity and like you know callers and stuff like that i don't like that so that's the way it should be and should have been i agree with you mike so you know fan mail stuff like that that's the kind of irl that i want to do i don't want to do like like I said, just I don't want to go out and have there's going to be drama and I don't want to do drama stuff anymore. That's really what I'm trying to say. I'm not really trying to stay wholesome as as much as uh, I'm not trying to explain it as like wholesome as in like offline TV shit per se. But I'm trying to just say I don't want drama shit. That's the whole point of what I'm trying to get across. Um, let me see what is this. Here's someone getting banned IRL from a mod. That's yes, he's my, he is my moderator, of course. Thank you, dude. Let's see. Fun while it lasted. South Diego's community will never be the same again. I mean, maybe. Like I said, I just got to step my game up pretty much. So that's that's really all. Um, I'm kind of glad that the Reddit died off a little bit. Um, because now we can start it up. I don't understand why there is so much hate. Understand that it is only percent. So don't cater to these toxic haters. Oh, don't also, worry. Also, is Chad's editor still your editor? As I have been enjoying your latest videos. Yeah, Chad's editor is still my editor. So here's the thing. I'm kind of glad the, the Reddit died off a little bit because now we can s try to restart it with like a better vibe. You know what I mean? Instead of like, because uh, if I never closed the Reddit, then it would have stayed very like drama based. So now we can restart it with no drama stuff, which was the thing that I wanted to do anyways originally. So, um, which will be interesting. Let me see. It's just me, but I feel like CX just started. I mean, that would be uh, that. That's that's interesting. I mean, it does feel like that, doesn't it? Like I said, it's a new era. It's a new era. This is just the end of an era, dude. Honestly, this uh, the last week here. No one's I'm... going back to that crappy Reddit. We got our own Reddit now, Yank. Recap high key too. Um, I mean, and y'all can have fun there. I mean, as long as my Reddit doesn't have a bunch of drama, I don't really care where, where the drama people go. If y'all want drama, there's other places to go for drama. Uh, but my Reddit will not be drama-based Blatantly anymore. ignoring me. Charge backing everything. Let me see, what'd you say here? Do you feel like you're a bad friend? You depressed? Um, I'm not depressed, but I definitely have felt like I've been a bad friend, for sure, for the past, uh, you know year or something but then again like i said all relationships started on motives 
for the past year, so it's not made me feel so fulfilled, which is awful, but... No drama. Uncensored real memes. We eating good out here on IP, too. Thank you, dude. I appreciate it very much, homie. Uh, so have you been playing old school RuneScape? Yeah, I've been. Uh, I just got 80 fishing last night, so I'm very close to minnows on my ultimate Iron Man. So uh, yes, I've been playing a lot of old school RuneScape recently, and I've been loving it actually. I wish uh, I, it's, I wish I like I could stream it, but it's just like no, like most of my viewers don't watch RuneScape, so it's like I feel like it's detrimental. You know, I don't think it's a good thing to actually stream because I don't think most people know what the fuck's going on. Like I still will do it every once in a while, but I don't want to do it, like, consistently, like, every fucking day or something, so, it's not, uh, it's not great. Move to Gotham City, heard Batman's getting bored, oh, out of Gotham City, I guess it's New York City, right, so, no, it's too cold there, I don't like New York City, dude, fuck that, so, I don't know, just do members only for it, well, that's what I have been doing with the RuneScape streams, Rosh Toilet, honestly. Rosh Toilet, how the fuck have you been, homie? How the fuck is your, uh, your your whole thing that you told me about when we met going? Is it still going pretty well? Old Ice Chug Monsters into Dead Man Mode Beta. New Ice does 10% nicotine and does Ultimate Iron Man. Hey, 60% nicotine. 6% or whatever. Like, this is 60 milligrams. And, yes, Ultimate Iron Man is the new age stuff. It's really fun. D Dude, Dead Man Mode's dead. Nobody plays that shit anymore except for, like, Fran. He gets banned from it, so. Or Tor Torvesta, sorry. Uh, which is uh, interesting. I do want to the next the next big event. I hate you, but they also love you. Hate you, love you. <laughs> well, thank you, dude. Um, I'm glad. You, thank you very much. I love you too. Um, the next big event move to Gotham City is going to be a travel I stream Batman again. Is bored. But that's not going to happen until after I already move. I mean, I guess it could be like uh, if I, you know, do like a party, a going away party. In what happened to Skin Ass Candy? I miss that. It too is full of rejects. I'd rather have a dead Reddit than those assholes in layers. Well, thank you, man. I appreciate that. What happened to Ski Mask Andy? I don't know. Are you what trying to get back to Twitch? Um, I'm just trying to, you know, get away from all the drama stuff. That's the whole main thing here. What happened to Boulder's Hatch Radio Show? I don't know. I mean, we aren't really supposed to stream in L.A., so... You know, that's why he hasn't been streaming. So don't take it too personally if you haven't seen Bulls had to do the radio show. But I'm assuming he'll get right back to it when he can. So, uh, you know, it just takes time in due time. I apologize to Astral from Discord. Apologize to Astral from Discord. He toxic now. Uh, Astral's not toxic. He's a, he's a weirdo, but he's a good dude. So it's all good. I know he was offended when I said he was a weirdo, but he is a fucking weirdo. But that's not a bad thing. So it's all good. You said you love me too when it's the wedding? <laughs> Listen, dicks. I always love you, homie, and it's, that's never going to end. Thank you very much, dude. I appreciate it. But, yeah, I mean, I don't know what to do for the next week. Like I said, I'm just, I, I, w I would, like, po pull stuff up and, like, show you guys, oh, you like, said you love me where too. I want to live Wednesday and stuff, wedding. and you give me, like, feedback, but that's not, I can't do that, because <laughs> people are going to, some people are going to try and, like, I think, fuck, fuck it up for me, so, uh, like, I, I, I can't really share where I want to move. It just has to happen. People judging me for my opinion slapping in the coochie. Let me see. What is this? Judging me for my opinion. Yikes. Are you on drugs or something? I think you may have donated to our streamer. You're just as delusional as Ice Piss. Hey, Andy. Ice, can you check your social blade for us and show us our success? Uh, thank you, dude. I appreciate that. I mean, there's no success, but thank you. I appreciate it. Um, Okay, this guy wants to talk really mad shit. Thank you, dude. This is what I do to people like that. Just like so. Thank you very much. I mean, if you want to talk shit about somebody who wants to throw me fucking $20, then I'm sorry, but I'm going to have to block you, dude. Because Grizzly's a good dude. Not because he threw me $20, but because motherfucking he's saying really nice things. And if you're going to be salty about that, I don't know what to say. If you want to, like, talk shit about me, that's fine. But don't talk shit about somebody who's being nice to me. That's fucked up. Thank you, dude. Swamp, how you doing? But, yeah, I don't, I'm going to be real, y'all. I don't know what to do for the next week in L.A. I, I really don't. Like, I don't want to not stream, but it's just going to be, uh, it's just going to be, like, like, gaming and shit, I guess. Like, I, I don't know. It's, uh, you know, stuff I have to figure out. Let me see. I think it's awesome to watch you grow up. Everyone go through change. You're doing it right. Thank you, Anthony. I'm, I've definitely grown up a lot in the past year. I've grown up fucking so much, dude, more than I ever have. I have been through a lot, a lot of shit, and I have 
it has made me a different person. It has made me a, I think it's made me a better person. I mean, a year ago, I was like, I just valued different, different things. You know what I mean? I value so much better things now. You know, a year ago, I valued money. You can be my Gucci bag and be lol. Fuck IP2. Thank you, P. Thank you, Dex. I appreciate that. A year ago, I probably valued money and success and stuff. And I really sacrificed a lot of things. I sacrificed personal relationships for money and success. And I don't do that anymore. You know what I mean? I sac I would rather sacrifice money and success for having personal relationships with people, which obviously I'm not going to do because that's detriment that's that'd be detrimental. But there just needs to be a good balance. Whereas before, there was never a good balance with me. It was always just... I don't know. I was always, I was just, I was just selfish, you know, I was definitely selfish like a year ago, dude. And like, that's just what I'm trying to change. Thank you, James. I appreciate the member, dude. Thank you very much, homie. I mean, what do you guys think? How, how do you think I've changed now from a year ago? Positive ways or negative ways? Because, uh, let me tell you what my goal is. My goal is to sort of just have like a really wholesome, you know, wholesome CX community. in the chat. And, uh, you know, have really good vibes. I don't want to have drama vibes. That's just the goal that I'm aiming for right now. Ice, what are you more excited about? Avengers Endgame or Mortal Kombat 11? It's Mortal Kombat 11 for sure. Dude, I used to play Aaron Black, and I used to combo the fuck out of people so cheaply, but it was fun. Um, I don't really care about Avengers and action, action movies. They're kind of... Ice, you know, what are you more excited about? Avengers Endgame or Mortal Kombat 11? Yeah, Mortal Kombat 11. I mean, I could stream it. That'd be fun. Um, when Drunk it comes gaming out. stream. Donations for shots. PLZZZZZ. Dude, I'll get so wasted, though, and then I'll just say some fuck this shit, but I'm okay with it. That'd be fun. I could do that. Um, you're on the right path by missing old content, old vibes. Well, the old the, the, the vibes I want to go back to is the shit that I was doing in 2016. Those are the vibes that I want to go back to. No stream for Kovacs. No, I, don't I, want, I don't want to do Flight. 2017, 2018 vibes anymore. I don't like those vibes anymore. I want to do 2016 vibes, which is just like chill. Fuck, not chill. It's like, this is like, it's just like nice, you know? It's just like it, people were nice to each other. Like, that's what I want. Um, no iPad, no flight. Stop lying. Let me tell you something, meaty. Before I leave LA, I'm going to get rid of all my loose ends, okay? I'm going to fly out three people from America. Ask you once apology. What do you think I'm of saying, cancels? I'll, I'll, I'll fly out three fans from America before I leave LA. Um, and I'll give away a fucking iPad. And yes, from America, because I can't afford to fly out people from fucking internationally. Fuck that. Like, I just can't afford it. So I'll fly three people domestically. And then I will uh, do the iPad thing. So don't worry. I'm going to clear all my loose ends. And uh, definitely not from, not from Hawaii, though. Ex excluding Hawaii, though. Sorry, dude. You can clip it. That's fine. Go ahead, clip this. But I'm telling you, it's gonna happen. I'm setting myself up right now. I know, but uh, I need to get rid of the loose ends. Whether I mean, I should financially, I should not do that. But you know, I should. I'll just do it because I think it's gonna be good for me to do, even though I should not do it. Where the fuck did my thing go? It's not hard. Take a day or two and drive to Orange County and stream. Find an event outside law. Show some initiative to your fans. Show you're willing to go out of your way. Well, I went to Japan. That was uh, going very out of the way. Um, like I said, I don't want to do like I have to plan some IRL, dude. And I'm I'm just I have like I was packing some shit today. Like I'm just like in the middle of like fucking moving, dude. Like it sucks. You know what I mean? I don't want to drive two hours to Orange County every fucking day, and then like have to plan something out and. Like, this is just not a good time for me, and, you know, it's just going to be pretty laid back until I can get myself on my feet, to be honest. Like, unfortunately, but, you know, I'm showing, I'm trying to show some initiative here. Um, I think you're on the right road. Your girlfriend's making you a better person. I see it. Thank you, dude. I, I'm trying, dude. Toxicity and conspiracy is literally coming from you not streaming regularly. I agree with that cellar door. It sucks, but, you know, I'm doing the best I can now, so it's fine. Like, I will change myself, for sure, and I, I think Ice I... Ice go and stream on D-Live for just today and show that weirdo. By using cringe Brit PDF file dirt back to the real king is and kick over his little house of cards with 10k real viewers. 
I don't know what that means, but uh, CX in the chat. Don't really care about going on D live, but maybe we'll see. You're an IRL streamer, gonna start being committed. GR vlogs, I agree, but I don't want to go stream in Orange County unless I have something actually planned to do out there, which there's not much to do out there except doing, I guess, normal IRL. But I don't want to do normal IRL. Let me see. You set up Destiny. You're irresponsible and untrustworthy. Uh, well, we're gonna meet up with Destiny tomorrow, so don't worry about that. Um, you know, I fucked up yesterday, but that's fine. I uh, thought it was Friday when it was really Saturday, so. And this guy said, that, you know, it's been negative. My new self is negative because I haven't streamed that much. Would and you I, ever go back to NoPixel on their GTA server? Uh, you know, maybe one day. But, uh, yeah, I mean, that'd be fun. But they wouldn't accept me at the moment, so. Because... There's a lot of Twitch streamers on there, and they would get banned. Um, what? Yeah, I, I'll still do Fear Factor type events. Like, I'll still do events, but just, I just don't want to do, like, shit that puts other people in a burden. Use. The search engine finds hidden cities that you can use to find cheaper flight tickets. Oh, I'll, I'll check that out. Thank you, dude. I appreciate that. What was I going to say? Um, yeah, I haven't streamed that much in, like, two months, and I'm sorry. I really am. Um, obviously, a lot of stuff's been going on, so... You know, it sucks, but I, you know, me personally, I think I've grown a lot as a person. I thought Dustin was smart, but he believed you would show up to meet him. Well, I'm meeting him tomorrow, pleb. Motherfucker just, I fucked up. It's fine, though. Like, he's, you know, he forgives me, so it's okay. Will you fly me out, Daddy? I'm a poor Romanian. How do you plan? <laughs> okay, I mean, uh, it's domestically. Sorry, man. How do you plan on doing... Uh, old events like UFCX, do you plan on building new casts or are you going to do it by yourself? Well, the first UFCX, I just did it with fans and viewers. So, you know, I'll figure it out. Either a new cast or, uh, you know, viewers or something. I, I don't know if I want to get a new cast specifically, though, because if I do, they can, I don't want them to be streamers. I don't want to, I don't want to build up streamers anymore. I, I don't think that's a good idea for me. Because in the end, most of the time, it always ends up with, you know, a falling out or, you know, negative Hi, connotations on the friendship. Randy, can you please ask Voldstad if we are still friends? I want to eat as I still think you love you. Let me see. Hi, yes, this is Vodka Andy. And can you please ask Voldstad if we're still friends? Yeah, I mean, he's not here, but I'm sure uh, you are still friends. You are losing from it? What do you mean? If you're losing from what, okay? Oh, yeah, lo from building streamers. Yeah, I don't want to build streamers. I want a new cast, but I don't want to build them as streamers. I just want them to be... Like, I, I just want to, like, remember when I first moved to L.A. and we had Kyle and Mexican Andy and these, you know, before anyone fucking streamed besides me? That shit was great, dude. Like, the relationships that I had there were so much more genuine. And when I build someone as a streamer, the relationship goes from genuine to something that's not. So, I don't want to, like, do that shit anymore. I just want to have, I can like, give you free hand jobs. Cheeky. People. Uh, and genuine ass relationships because I go into it with motivate or intentions as well. When I'm building someone as a streamer, I'm like, okay, I have negative intentions at the same time as them, and that's not a good way to start a friendship. But then again, you know, I don't know. It's just gonna be rough to uh, to figure out how like how do I become friends with people without using me as a streamer as like leverage to become friends with them. Like, I don't know, this is, it's a really bad mindset, but I don't know how to actually make friends with people without, without, without saying I'm a streamer, you know what I mean? I don't know how to feel about the content going forward. Most people watch for the craziness with CX people. Your viewer count has decreased a lot because it now feels like we're watching a different person. I don't know, most people watch for the craziness. <clears throat> I mean, clout, I'm purposely trying to uh be more laid back yeah i mean my content wasn't always craziness with cx people dude that's very recent i've been streaming for three and a half years and i had the cx network for a year and a half so most of my streaming career was without cx you know crazy cx people so it's just what i want to go back to i i was much happier when i was just Do you feel doing uncomfortable? stuff myself scam don't know bdw let me see. What did you say? I was much happier when it was just like more, more wholesome, dude, and not drama and shit. You can give free hand jobs. Thank you, Dex. I appreciate that, homie. 
Constance is the whole thing when you moved to LA because no one was using you as a streamer for their own gain. Thank you, Kay. I mean, it's probably about right. Um, what was I going to say? Yeah, careful how I word this. Yeah, no, don't worry. I'm not looking for, I just, I'm looking for genuine people. I'm not looking for people to use this content who don't want to slice of the pie. That's obviously not what I'm trying to say. Um, somebody will twist my words probably, but that's not what I was trying to go for. I don't know. We'll see how it all goes. Let me see. You need to watch out how much bullshit you will start by believing your own lies. <laughs> Um, what do you mean? How much, I don't know what that means, Tyler. How about this? Since a lot of people don't believe that I will actually fly three people out, I'll do this. I don't know how, I, actually, I don't know how I'm going to do the, the giveaway or the flying out people thing, but I'll do this. Since y'all in the chat have been very, very chill and very nice, if anybody who says me in the chat, I will randomly pick someone in the chat who wants to fly out to LA and I will do, I'll just buy your tickets right the fuck now. I'll buy three people's flights right now if you live in the U.S. domestically in the chat. And uh, I pick you guys in the chat because y'all have been fucking nice. Y'all have not been fucking assholes to me. Uh, and y'all literally should get something back for being fucking, you know, pretty chill and pretty nice. I want to start adding more, uh, I don't know, reference like the nice people. So I don't know how to actually, I wish there was like a thing. Is there like a thing where you could roll a dice? You know how on Twitch they have like a rolling a dice option. You could pick someone randomly from the chat. How the fuck do I do that on YouTube? How do I randomly pick someone from the chat without... Because uh, I could just close my eyes and pick someone, but that's not going to be as fair, I feel. Okay, thank you, Oscar. Thank you, Ricardo. Appreciate it. <laughs> um, I don't want to, like... Uh... My nice daddy, Tom. Thank you, No Legs. I appreciate it. Um, let me see. How do I... Let me, let me look this shit up. I know Nightbot had, like, a thing. Let me see if Nightbot still has that thing. Um, one second. Let me close... Let me put this over the thing here. Thank you, man. This is not a sponsor fucking giveaway, dude. So don't, don't, uh, don't just sponsor randomly right now and say me. Like, that's not, that's unfair to people who have been sponsored for a long time. But thank you. Anyways, new guys, I appreciate it. Um, okay, let's log into Nightbot here. CX in the chat. Let's see if they have a, uh, a dice rolling thing. All right, thank you, Dex. I appreciate it. I'm not ignoring you, dude. I just, uh, I just didn't see it pop up. CX in All the right, chat. All right, giveaways right here. All right, right here. All right, so let's figure out how this shit works. Okay, thank you, Fizzy. I appreciate that. So you CX guys, CX in the chat. Anyone who wins this, you have to message me. You have to like tell me what your fucking Twitter is. You should make a Twitter now if you don't have it. Message me what on fuck or tell me where your Twitter is and then I will message you and then we'll go from there. Um, all right, so how do we do this? Still ignoring me, BDW. Actually, charge backing. Okay, so all I have to do is let's see keyword. So type in CX in the screen. chat. Let's see how this is gonna work. Let's block the screen real quick. Random number. And then when I fly you guys out. We can do like, uh, I don't know, we can go out and just hang out for a couple days. CX in the chat. Or something, dude. And you, make sure you don't have a fucking job as well, because how are you going to take your job off? And don't quit your fucking job either. I'm literally gonna, it's going to be like a two or three day thing. All right, so this is how it's going to work. I made it, so you have to type a number. CX in the chat. So you have to type a number. And whoever can guess the number in the chat there's two winning numbers so you just just type numbers in the chat whoever picks the the, the numbers that the winning Times number have will win the play. people have gotten used to the type of content you have now is not 2016 anymore ice why not do a poll asking fans if they preferred cx content wholesome or a mix of both i mean most people are going to want the crazy shit but it's been detrimental to my happiness and i, I just haven't been having a good time with that so all right, so like I said, pick. there's two numbers, two winning numbers that you can choose from right now. You have to choose, try to pick the winning number in the chat. And then obviously I will roll the dice and then whoever picked the winning numbers will be the winners. So let me do the first roll right here.
Me plus a long time fan. All right, so whoever types number right now, the first person to type this number will be the winner. I, I just rolled it. Nobody's picked the number yet. So it says waiting for a winner. So whoever picks the number right now will be the first winner here. You have to find the number though. Just keep spamming the chat with numbers until it shows up on the screen as the winner. I'm blocking the screen right now because it shows the winning number on the fucking screen and I don't want to show the winning number. So it says waiting for a winner right now. Somebody just needs to find the fucking number. If you find the number, you type the number, then you will win. A flight, I will fucking just give me your goddamn Twitter. I'll send you the fucking details and then we'll, we'll uh, fly you out and do this. And I will just redeem myself entirely from that fucking bullshit, close all my loose ends, and then I can move the fuck away from LA, go to a new place, start a new fucking era, and get the fuck away from the loose ends. Don't have, people don't have to worry about this shit no more. And look what we have here. Hold on. We have a winner. Right here, dude. Real Jordan. He's been sponsored. Or subscribed, I guess, since 2017. And uh, the, the winning number, messages, 64. The winning number was 64. So, real Jordan in the chat. Where are you, dude? Where the fuck are you in the chat, homie? Make yourself known. I don't know if this shit was glitchy, so like if you type 64, I don't know why it didn't work. CX then. in the chat. For the number, motherfucking 64, dog. Where are you, Jordan? Let me uh, at you in the chat here. All right, right here. So you're going to have to, what up? Okay, so you're going to have to make a Twitter. or Do you have a Twitter, dude? CX in the chat. Do you have a Twitter? You're going to have to send me shit on Twitter right here. Just give me your Twitter right now. Just type it and it'll show up right here. Just give me your Twitter. CX in the chat. Okay, just type it, dude. And I will uh, DM you on Twitter, and then we can go, and then we'll, you know, we'll go from there. I want every, I want all the, the three, the people, the three people that I fly out, I want you guys, to, you're coming on the same date. Because, obviously, yeah, I'm going to figure out, like, I'll get, like, a hotel or something, I'll figure out how we're going to get this shit to work, and then we'll stream with you guys and uh, go from there, but we need to figure out how this is going to, you know, y'all have to come on the same day, so... Let me out. Never went anywhere. Well, uh, CX in the chat. You need to obviously uh, just type the numbers in the chat. You see, real Jordan. Okay, right here. So let me actually DM you real quick on Twitter. CX in the chat. Um, real Jordan. Thank you, Jay. Can't appreciate it. All right. All right, so we got you. All right, let's get two more people then. All right, so I'm gonna hide this again. And by the way, if you think this is like bullshit, all I have to do is cancel and then minimum 66. Okay, I don't know why 64 won. I don't really know how this works. Let's, let's try a keyword this time. I'm gonna go to a keyword, so you have to type the keyword. I'm gonna give you hints, you have to type the keyword in the chat and that should hopefully not be so glitchy like the random number CX thing. CX in the chat. All right. So, what's the what's the keyword gonna be here? All right. We'll make it a test. We'll make it a quiz. We'll see who's an old fag in the chat. We'll do an old fag test. So let me think of a of a keyword real quick, and then I'm gonna give you a riddle, and then you have to obviously guess the riddle, and then that's the word. One second, let me try to figure this out. Thank you, DJ. Appreciate the motherfucking member, homie.
we do it. What was the first game that I played that was not RuneScape? What was the first game I played that was not RuneScape? The first game I went and I fucking... What was the first game I branched off from that wasn't RuneScape? The very first one. The very first one. This is an old fag question. How old of a viewer are you? How long have you been watching? You. This is like a three-year-old question. What was the first game I branched off from RuneScape? No one has said it yet. No one has said it. Mike, if you really think it was Arma, you are nuts, dude. CX in the chat. The very first game that I branched off from that was not RuneScape. And I played this game. I played this game for like an hour. And then after I played this game, I'm pretty sure we played Outlast. So it went. we were playing RuneScape, and then I was like, fuck it. And then we played something else. And then we played that for an hour. And then we played Outlast after. So what did I play before Outlast? It's the first thing I ever branched off RuneScape from. I don't think anyone's really going to guess this. If you, if you don't have it already, I... Oh, somebody got it. It was Slender Man. Fabian, you actually got it, bro. It was, uh, I played Slender Man for an hour. It was the first fucking thing I branched off RuneScape from. So, uh, let's see, Fabian. What's your Twitter, dude? Okay, thank you, Fresh Pick Content. Thank you, dude. How you doing, homie? Slender Man, that shit, that doesn't count? No, Slender Man does fucking count. What are you saying? Oh, he's typed it wrong. Okay. Fabian, what's your uh, what's your Twitter account, dude? And then we have one more person after that can potentially. Uh, I agree with you. Slice. Just gonna do wholesome content going forward. Be ready to lose a lot of it. Said you should include Kim and Vold more on your wholesome streams. It would help. You know, I'm gonna say it this way. I would rather be happy with less viewers than be stressed the fuck out and unhappy with more CX viewers. in the chat. Like it's it's. It would just be better, like, I think for me, homie. No Twitter? Okay, Fabian, well, how do I contact you, bro? I'm just going to keep you in the chat here. Just how do I contact you, dude? So I can, uh, so we can send you that. Thank you, Josh. I appreciate the member, homie. All right, then one more. Let's do one more. And then this this one we'll just pick randomly from, from, uh, from fucking Nightbot here, okay? So let's see what we got here. Just an active user. I'll just roll it. Active user. Thank you, Same Productions. Appreciate it, homie. Yeah, just make a random fucking thing, Fabian. So, and when I click roll it, it's just going to roll someone in the chat. Let's see who's going to be the last winner here. And my suggestion is, when you fly out, be ready to get like a little What's bit of... What's cracking sexy hats out your heads now you got? Get, get ready to be like, like the chat might roast you, so just be careful. Like don't, don't come if you're offended by little things. And it's don't, CX in the chat. don't have, like, I mean, just make sure we can find free time. We gotta, I'm gonna put all of y'all in a group chat and we have to figure out a good date to do this on. Do you have a Twitter? Where do you live? Let's type this. Because obviously, like I said, domestic flights only. It's not BS. How the fuck is it BS? It's not BS. Like, I'm sorry. Hey, if you don't got good RNG, I don't know what to say. It's RNG, bro. If you don't type anything in the chat, then we're going to re-roll. So type something in the chat. You have like two minutes. Otherwise, we're re-rolling, bro. So let me, uh, let me get this timer up. Stop. Watch. Do you have two minutes to respond? Otherwise, uh... Reroll. Come on, homie. Come on, homie. Don't be a. How the fuck do you go AFK? How do you type in the chat and then go AFK? Don't go AFK, bro. That's not. Fuck. Oh, fuck. Shh. I was trying to close the. Oh, fuck me. Hold on.
It doesn't matter. I still have his name. Type something in the chat, bro. I still have your fucking name. Just type in the chat. It doesn't matter that I closed it. Just type in the motherfucking chat. You have two minutes. If I don't see your name in the chat, I have control F, so it's the same thing. Control F in the chat. Lebowski. Okay. I don't think he's here. Where is he? He's here. Type something, bro. Oh, there you are. Yo, dude, Lebowski. You won. What do you mean, huh? What? You won, dude. You won a fucking flight to come over and fucking hang out, dude. Where do you live and what is your Twitter? If you don't even know what's going on, like, do you want to take a flight? Thank you, Ozzy. Appreciate it, homie. Do you want to take a flight? Where do you live? What is your Twitter? <coughs> What's up, Strawberry Vision? Are you really a 13-year-old girl? Is that really you? Come on, bro. You cannot be all scuffed here. It's fucking type in the chat, homie. Dude, if he's like, no, if he's like eight years old, that'd be, that'd be bad. I mean, uh, you have to be over the age of 18. I mean, I guess you'd be 16, but that's weird, right? Like, fuck. Make sure the winners aren't underage. Yeah, I mean, that would not be good, right? If they were like 15 or something, that'd be fucking weird, dude. Bro, you have to answer the questions, Lebowski. And then, hey, Mike, or one of my moderators, can you just get in touch with Fabian to make sure he uh, sends me a Twitter? I want an iPad plus Gorilla. So, Fabian, do you not want to get flown out or what? Do we have to make another reroll? All right, I'm, I'm guessing we're going to have to. Uh... I want an iPad Paul. Screw LA. Bro, if you don't respond, we're going to reroll, homie. We need someone who's going to, like, talk to me here. Oh, Twitter, right there. Okay. There we go. All right, let me see. I'm good. All right, Fabian does not want a flight, actually, so... Why did you enter the fucking competition if you don't want a flight? Why the fuck? Why? All right, whatever. You fucking got some dopamine in your brain from that good RNG, so that's good. All right, let's re-roll then. He doesn't want it. Yeah, I agree, dude. Fuck LA. All right. But it's not about LA, bro. It's about coming and fucking hanging out, dude. All right, let's... Uh... Thank you, Johnny. Appreciate it, homie. Let's do re-roll one more time, dude. Here we go. Let's get this. Just type whatever the fuck. Just type something in the chat, and I'll just roll it, and then we'll see who wins. For a free flight to L.A. Los Angeles. Domestic only. I'm way too much from Nigel, dude. Fuck no. See, All right. in the chat. All right, let's roll it. Here we go. Oh, he plays RuneScape. Look at that. Hey, look. Where you at, bro? Where you at, dog? Hey, we can play old school RuneScape together on, on mobile, homie. What's up? Where you at, bro? Type something in the chat. What's your Twitter? Where do you live? Fuck in. What's up? Let's do it. Are you in the fucking CC, bro? Are you in the clan chat, dog? What are you? Who are you in the clan chat, homie? <laughs> Is he toxic as fuck? Oh, great. All right, that's fine. Let's fucking get him on stream then, bro. That's okay, bro. You'd be toxic to me in real life. That's fine. Come on, bro. Fucking. What did you say? What are you saying here? What did you say, fucking? Sorry, don't add retirement. Look over he. What do you mean? All right, what's your Twitter, bro? And where do you where do you live? Or just type, what's your Twitter, bro? Skip, you already met you in Denver. God, fucking damn it! This is the most 
scuffed giveaway ever, dude. What the fuck? I, you already met me in Denver? But, dude, just do it. That would be a cheap flight from Denver to L.A. It's like $100. Can you just fucking do it? So you save goddamn money? All right. We're going to re-roll it then. All right. Let's try this again. Did you play RuneScape 2, bro? Could have played mobile together. Motherfucker. Alright, let's try one more time then. Let's we'll see if the new guy will do this. Alright, goodbye, look. <laughs> this guy just fucking... Okay. What's up, dude? Where are you at, content? Fresh picked content. Where, where are you, homie? Where are you? You... you it, that's, that's not fair, because you literally just... I don't even know how long you've been watching, but you literally just fucking sponsored today, so where are you? We're, we're, type something in the chat. Where are you, bro? Hey, what's up, dude? Fucking. Yeah, it's a scam. It's not a scam, dude. You got. I have one mon. Oh, I have two monitors. There's, there's nothing. Trust me. There's no no rigging I bullshit. I agree to hold some content going forward, but at the least, when you do, Vince invite some CX members instead of random viewers. It'd be better. There's no rigging here, dude. All right. Type something, dude. Type something. You gotta cut. You got two minutes, bro. Type something. Oh, is your Twitter your actual? Is your Twitter just your fucking name, dude? Okay, fuck it, dude. Uh, all right, let's go. Let's see what we got here. <laughs> oh, you're from Florida. Okay, that's dope. Fucking, I'm from there too. All right, good shit, bro. You're actually very close to where you used to live, actually. Okay. All right, there you go, fucking, just like that, homie. Just like that. Now, those are the three people that we're gonna fly out. Okay, so we're just gonna get that done. Fucking close the loose ends. Those are the three people we're gonna fly out. Now, an iPad. Now, I never specified on the kind of iPad that I would give away. Okay. I never specified that. And by the way, if you see three... You'll see these guys very soon. Like, trust me, it's not a scam. You guys will see three people very soon. I never said what kind of iPad. I just said an iPad. So it's not going to be a new iPad because that's like $1,500. It's going to be... What's a, what's the cheapest functional iPad? What's like a good... I, like a cheapest good iPad? I have the name until the last three winners. I know that we did this competition like a year ago, Jacob. I don't know if those people are still around. Give me the names of the last three winners, and uh, if I'll try to message them. If they're uh, still around, then they'll overwrite the, the new ones. But I don't know if that's fair, though. I mean, it's literally a year old. Scarce gave you a thousand super... I, t Victor, shut the fuck up. Scarce literally DM'd me and said it was not for a fucking iPad. He said it was just for the meme. But I'm going to give away an iPad. Okay, I cannot give away a fucking thousand dollar iPad right now. This is not, I, I just can't. It's not, uh, I have to move. I can't do that. So I'll give away, let, let's, let's type here. What do we have? iPad. <laughs> here we have here. Oh, look, let's see. What do we have here? iPad. How much is an iPad 2? Okay. Oh, $185. Oh, $185. Okay. Who wants an iPad 2? It's only $185. $185. Fuck it, dude. Oh, my gosh. Okay, let's see what an iPad 5 is. $329.
How much is the, what's the newest generation of iPad? <laughs> Just give them the cash. What is, uh, what's the new generation iPad called? An iPad 12? Okay. Let me see, what's the price of an iPad 12? No, that's, a, that's a joke, isn't it? Why is this shit in yen? Okay, the iPad. I'll just give. What about iPad Mini? Right, those are pretty good. iPad Minis. Those are, those are good. Those are really good. Let's just do an, a Mini because I, I actually used to own a Mini and they're really really good. Um, and that they're like four hundred bucks. So we'll do an iPad Mini. So, if you would like to win, let me see. What is this Hondo? What do we have here? Oh, retracted. Okay. If you would like to win an iPad Mini. Then type in the chat. I'm giving away crap. Okay, well, whoever fucking wins can just decide whether or not they just want the $400 or if they want the fucking iPad, okay? Like, they can just decide whether or not they want the iPad or just the fucking money. Like, I don't really care, dude. fucking guy dude hey play where are you at though where are you at though no thank you he says wow you literally don't want a free ipad literally a free ipad dude thank you benny appreciate it homie how's this rig what, what motherfucker i'll pass okay on to the next one then who wants to see who wants an ipad dude <laughs> Hey, he's OG as fuck, though. What's going on, Imp? How you doing, bro? OG as fuck. Where you at, homie? <laughs> this motherfucker, dude. Where you at? Type, type some, dude. What's your Twitter, dog? What's your Twitter, homie? Just give it to me. At least it's an OG, bro. You're OG. He's OG as fuck. This dude's like a one-year uh, motherfucking sub, homie. He's been around for a while. CX in the chat. Thank you, dude. I appreciate that, homie. Where are you, dude? Imp Wiz. Okay. I know you've messaged me a lot on, on Twitter, haven't you? Let me see. Hold on. What do we got here? All right. Let's uh, go on Twitter. I know you've messaged me a lot on it. Let me see what your messages were. Oh, he's a two months sub. Okay, it doesn't matter. You know what? I'm glad that you won. Because this is a very nice message. Bro, it was great seeing you on stream today. Honestly, it felt super organic. It's super entertaining. Good choice to leave LA and see where the channel takes you. I'm so glad that you fucking won, dude. Because you seem like a nice ass dude. Alright. Alright, so what do you want, dude? Do you want the iPad or do you want just the, the money for what it's worth? Well, with that being said, we have the winners then. So there you go. The, the loose ends are tied. I will fly these guys out. You will see three people. Uh, I'm assuming soon we have to pick a date or, or like two, two dates um, that they have. They're not, they're not working or at school or whatever. And then we will uh, we will fly them out, and we will do this. And I hope that they don't live all over the place, because that's going to cost me an arm and a leg. So I only picked two winners. No, we have three three flights, and then we have the iPad. I'll take the cash. Okay, there we go, dude. He kicks the cash, so he'll give me Galaxy his, Fold giveaway. He will give me his PayPal. There you go. Winner of the Photoshop contest. Jacob, the winner of the Photoshop contest was promised, I believe, a a, um, a flare on Reddit. So, 
pretty sure we gave the flares on Reddit, right? Or are we talking about the winner of the new, the other, I don't know. Did you get a flare on Reddit? There you go. If you want a flare on Reddit, you got a flare on Reddit. There you go, homie. So there, that's it. He takes the cash. He'll, uh, I'll just send him money on PayPal. Easy enough. And then we have the three uh, flight winners as well. Flight. You know the Lebowski guy? That one? He's, he says he lives in LA anyways. Best decision I've made in life. See you in Dallas. Thank you, Fabian. I appreciate that, homie. Hold on. He literally says he lives in LA anyways. This is perfect. I live in LA anyways. That's just perfect. I love it, dude. I, I fucking love it. That saves me like $300. That's great. Uh, let me see. And then we have Jordan and then we have Jason. So no, I'm not going to re-roll. He won fair and square. So, Hey, he won fair and square. That's a, uh, that's, that's uh that's not flying someone out, but he won. I'm not just going to motherfucking re-roll dude. That's not fair. But you know what, since Lebowski can just come over and meet me any fucking time and come over to the house and hang out any fucking time, I will just re-roll anyways because I don't want people to just be like, he missed, he didn't fly out a third person, he just rigged it. So, buy, yeah, I can buy him a flight out of LA, how about that, dude? So I'll just re-roll one more time, dude. So let's try this one more time. This is the most scuffed giveaway I've ever done in my life. This is the only giveaway I've ever done in my life. This is why I don't do giveaways, bro. Yeah, right, dude. <laughs> Dude, don't you live in Hawaii, bro? No. I said no Hawaii, Pooker. I'm sorry, bro. We already... I already said that. I know. And I, you know what? We've already met each other. We don't need to fly you out, homie. I'm sorry. You don't live in motherfucking... Uh, the domestic U.S. But thanks for playing. Well, I said domestic flights only. I'm sorry. You, uh, it's, no, I said, no, I said, hey, Victor, shut the fuck up. I said domestic, and then I said no Hawaii. That's literally what I said before I did this shit. Sorry, you met the stipulation, homie. Fucking, we're gonna have to re-roll, dude. Let me see, how much is a flight to Hawaii? What's for this week? Let me just see for a second. I'm not about to pay fucking a thousand dollars, dude. That's why I said domestic flights only. Unless you want... Actually, you know what, Pooker? You want a flight? I got you on a flight, homie. But it's going to be a... Uh, it's going to be a 30-hour flight with three layovers. That's, <laughs> that's what it's going to be, homie. Let me see. Pooker, what, what part of Hawaii do you live in? Do you live in uh, Honolulu or one of the scuffed islands? What's today? April 21st. So let's say one. Oh, it's actually not bad. From Hawaii, it's $480. It's really not bad at all. All right, Pooker, do you want this or what? You, there's a there, there's a five-hour nonstop flight from Honolulu. Do you want this or, or not? I thought it was going to be like fucking thousand dollars. I mean, we've already met, so it's a little unfair for some people, but do you want to, uh, do you want to come out or, or no? It's up to you, bro. This is a round trip. Yeah. 400 bucks. I did say no Hawaii, but since people are going to give me shit for it, I'll just do it. 
When's the date? Well, that's something we'd have to figure out. It's, uh, we have to pick a date that all three of you are going to be available on. I don't know the date. It's, we have to talk about it, obviously. All right, he's down. There you go. Got the winners. Give me your fucking Twitter and why well, I already know your fucking Twitter, I'm pretty sure. Let me message you real quick. I'm about to move out of LA. I am K. Uh, so we have to do this quick. <laughs> Otherwise, uh, fuck it, dude. They're gonna have to fly their ass to LA. But I'll be fucking somewhere else, dude. <laughs> okay, one second. Let me message him. Okay, what is on your Twitter, though? What's your Twitter? Poop. Hey, at least we got some OGs on this. Oh, these, these are some motherfucking OGS people. All right, there we go. We got the winners, just like that. And then Imp sent me his PayPal, so I'll PayPal him right now so nobody can say scam. Obviously, I'm not going to leak his PayPal stream, though. But he can just clarify if I did it or not in the chat. the fuck you have a fucking hotmail dude who the fuck is hotmail anymore all right Okay. There you go. Four hundred dollars. Four hundred dollars, dude. All right, there you go. Screenshot that, homie. No scam, nothing, dude. There we go. Lucky dude. Congratulations. Alright, cool. Now we just fly the dudes out and that's it. The motherfucking people can't say I, I fucking don't, never did that now. So when I fucking move out of LA, there's not going to be no LA drama involved with the move and nobody can fucking look up shit from, that I did in LA and be like, yo, you fucking still owe this and that and this and that. And it's like, nope, no, I don't owe shit no more, dog. It's done. That's it. Okay, no more. Is is Dunsky, dude. <laughs> okay, God, that was. I, I hate. This is the worst time to give away money, dude. Yeah, I'm, I'm kind of moving shit, but it's fine. It's not a big deal. Free nitro. What the fuck are you saying? All right. Uh, Photoshop contest. Which fucking one, dude? Uh, Reddit flare. Okay, I never said what the prize would be for the Photoshop contest. I'll give out a Reddit flare. There you go. <clears throat> Congratulations. <coughs> only four hundred dollars. Okay, Strawberry Vision, aren't you thirteen? What do you mean only four hundred dollars? If I pay for my own ticket from the UK, can I come chill on a day? Love to meet you. Literally work and watch you all day. I mean, if you pay for your own flight and hotel, sure. Yeah, why not, bro? That seems fine to me. Fuck it, dude. That's like fuck that. Yeah, sure, dude. That's fine. Reddit flare on a dead Reddit. Uh, Timothy, why are you, why do you want to be unmodded? Like, let me tell you, why do you want to be unmodded, Timothy? Like, tell me why I should not unmod you right now. In fact, you don't even mod anymore. So I should unmod you. Because you're fucking a dead mod. You don't even, un, you don't even mod anymore. You just come when there's a giveaway and then you fucking leave, dude. That's literally all you do. 
Okay. Everyone else is actually mods the chat. Literally, you're just a dead mod, homie. <laughs> and jokes on you, mods were not eligible because I know if a mod fucking won the giveaway, people would just say fucking I don't know, like fucking bullshit. They'd be like, "Yeah, this is rigged." Or some shit. And I'd probably be like, listen, I'd DM you and be like, listen, if I have to fall your ass out, you're a mother. You're and debt to lawyers. You're the man I love you. And what about the community service you're getting that done? Oh, yeah, yeah. I, I paid off the lawyers, dude. It's bad. Yeah, that, that's my bank account's not looking too good after the lawyership. <laughs> well, but I just gave free money to the lawyers, dude. I fucking hate it so much, dude. I want the neck when I, I, I really want a neck, but it's okay. Um, Yeah, I'll do the community service. Don't even worry about that. I'm not like, I'm busy for a leave. Yep, of course, Dylan, that's fine. That's good shit. Okay, there we go. Music video winner. Oh, yeah, music video winner. Let's just start with this. Okay, let's just start with this. Let's see how much the, the flights are going to cost me, dude. Because, like, motherfucking... Actually, yeah, the, the, the one guy, the Biff guy, he does actually live not too far. So I could just add him to the, to the list, dude, honestly. You have never gone through with a giveaway. What makes you think well believe this is real? I mean, you could just ask fucking Impwiz, I guess. I mean, I literally just sent it. You could just ask him. I mean, I don't really care, to be honest. As long as I know I did it, I don't really care what you think. Okay, I'm about to have, like, a whole gang of people over in the, uh, over here in L.A. with me, dog. So, yeah, okay, first class. Pooker, I'm, get, I'm putting your ass in coach, dog. I'm putting your ass in coach next to the fattest motherfucker on the plane. Who smells like shit with a behind a crime baby? Okay, that's what I'm gonna do, Pooker. <laughs> I mean, but hey, it's still a free flight, so it's all good. I'm gonna put your ass on a fucking three-hour fucking layover, dude. How about that? Asking for first class, homie. What the hell's wrong with you? <laughs> All right, well, we got that done. There you go. Fucking, I'm going to get the, the dates here for these guys, and uh, we'll go from there. I just messaged uh, the music video winner, see if he wants to be added to the list as well. We'll go from there, dude. Am I going to stream with that dumb permit? Uh, well, okay, what we're going to do is we're going to have to drive to uh, Orange County when the, when the winners come, and we'll just have to stream there, I guess. And I'll just uh, we'll go to a park or something. Like I don't know, we'll do some shit, but we're not gonna we're not gonna do no. I don't, I'll figure out something to do. We'll, we'll get like maybe you know cooking stream going. I don't know. We'll do something with these guys, but it's not gonna be you need to fucked buy. by callers. You need to buy this. What is this? Let me see. Hold on. What do you donate here? What is this? What the fuck is this? Constantino Silver Poseidon Pendant. What the fuck is this, dude? That that actually looks pretty fucking cool. But I don't fucking want $384, dude, for what, dude? Fucking silver? Fuck that shit. EBZ con? Yeah, okay, yeah, EBZ con, dude. Yeah, motherfucking... We, we are not doing EBZ con, bro. EBZ messed that up for himself way back when we were going to do it. So no, we're not doing no EBZ con for me. Sorry, that's... that's that. I, I need a permit, too. Like, fuck, that's not happening. That's not happening. Sorry, dude. Like I'm, tr I try. I need to move and shit. This is not the time. Okay, it's not the time. I gotta, gotta put my, my money and and moving costs here. So fuck that. <laughs> fuck that. We'll do EBZ Con in a park. Fuck. You know what? We'll do. Fuck it. We'll do EBZ Con. We'll do it in a park with, you know, and viewers can come and I'll I'll build like a little stage. I'll give them like a fucking microphone, dude. Like fucking Blue Yeti. That's how we'll do it. We'll get like confetti. Balloons, all this shit, okay? We'll do EBZ Con that way. I never said it was going to be a high quality event. I'll bring fucking cheap fucking $5 vodka. There you go, EBZ Con. And then the, the yeah, the, the tomatoes and shit, dude. Yeah, Bjorn Con, yeah. How about, how about Victor Con? How about that, okay? We'll do, we'll do some Victor Con. After that, we'll do fucking Neb Con. After that, we'll do fucking Jacob Con. After that, we'll do, uh, do, we'll do a con for everybody. How about that? I would like a Victor Con actually. I think that'd be good. We can uh, we can have a bunch of screaming SSJs as well. Uh, pin the tail on the SSJ, um, or you know something. We have Victor in the middle. We like try to pick him up in the chair, but the chair fucking breaks. So you know, we'll, it'll be fun. <laughs> uh, 
Okay, well, listen. Victor hate thread con. <laughs> dude, just a bunch of Victor hate threads, dude. That's fine, dude. Fuck it, dude. Okay. I'm not smoking any more cigarettes, beer. Don't worry about that. Trust me, homie. You need to have a viewer meetup before you move? I... We can do that. I'll, I'll do that. I mean, we do viewer meetups all the time, but I'll definitely do another one. Fuck it, dude. I did not promise in Silicon. That was Kyle. That was not me. Sorry, dude. It was Khan who was at Elixir's birthday party. I mean, that's actually kind of true. <laughs> EVZ <laughs> did perform at Elixir's birthday party, and I was there to give him my blessing. So, you know what? We could still do another one, though. I'll just invite Elixir, all his friends. You know, that'll be good shit, dude. So, don't worry. <laughs> okay, well, Game of Thrones just started. I'm going to go watch Game of Thrones. You need to have a viewer meetup before you go. move. This, this, this stream was... The redemption of the the tier three sub flyouts, which they had tier three subs don't exist anymore, so we just did these subs and these people. So and motherfucking, we did that. I gave fucking, I did the iPad giveaway. Fucking, never talk to me about this shit again. <laughs> never talk to me about this shit ever again. Okay, I'm gonna go watch Game of Thrones. I'm streaming again tomorrow, and the next day, and the next day, and the next day. Motherfucking, probably. I don't know what the fuck we're gonna do. I'll figure it out. LA's fucking trash right now. I'm still looking for a place to live. Bug it, dude. We'll figure it out. Uh, all right. We'll see you guys later. Peace. Short stream. Sorry, but, you know, so we'll make it longer tomorrow. All right, guys. Peace. Love you. Goodbye. And when the three winners come, like, be nice to them, please. That would be great. Okay. Later, dudes. Love you.